You're listening to the BBM Global Network with 25 years in broadcast audio and video production. Our passionate team creates content and marketing for the world of Internet talk radio. If you've got a passion, come join us at BBMGlobalNetwork.com. The BBM Global Network. Your voice is now heard. Welcome to Spiritual Awakenings with your host, Marsha Hebrink. Listen now as Marsha explores the mystery of angels. Who are angels? How can they help us? And how can we connect with these wonderful beings of light to enlighten and enrich our lives? So now, please welcome the host of Spiritual Awakenings, Marsha Hebrink. Welcome, everybody. I'm Marcia Hebrank, and this is Spiritual Awakenings. And we're coming to you live from the BBM Global Network and TuneIn Radio. And today we're talking about angels and spiritual healing and crystals and stones. And uh, my goodness, I've been busy. I don't know about you guys. I hope you're having a good week. Um, May here in beautiful North Carolina has been amazing. We did get some rain over the weekend, but uh, my husband and I were teaching core shamanism for the Foundation for Shamanic Studies all weekend. And our students, our class of 17 students, all did beautifully. And the class um, that we were teaching is called Shamanism, Dying and Beyond. And it helps the students to understand uh, the process of dying, how to help people who are on their way out, and how to help folks who have left their bodies but need some help getting to the light, uh, among other things. It's a very amazing class. Uh, You have to take the basic workshop, which is called the We of the Shaman first, before you take that one. But uh, we had a big weekend. It was absolutely wonderful. All the students did really, really, really well. And I'm just still very proud of them and very excited for their progress that they made in the class. So this week, got back to work and started seeing my clients and um, have done some angel work and some shamanic healing and some medical intuitive work all uh, since I got back to uh, being here in my office and seeing folks. So I hope wherever you are that you're having a good week and enjoying this amazing springtime weather. Um, I had a friend out here from Minnesota who took the class and uh, she was very happy to be in some warmth because they still had had snow out where she lives. So wherever you are, I hope it's not snowing, but of course that can be beautiful too, can't it? So I have a very special angel to talk about on the show today. And It's interesting the way that the angels kind of bring things through for me. Every time I do a show, I'll think, well, gosh, who who should I talk about this time? You know, which angel or aspect of working with angels should I share about on the show? And today, I just saw this big O, you know, in the air. And then I saw spelled out Orion, O-R-I-O-N. And I thought, well, okay, Orion wants to be uh, shared about clearly. And this, I have to tell you, is an archangel that I do not know a whole heck of a lot about. But I will be glad to share with you today about what I do know. And uh, perhaps we can do a meditation today to meet with Orion and uh, see what else we can find out about him. So um, Archangel Orion, and it's O-R-I-O-N is an archangel that is fairly new to the scene um, in the grand scheme of things. Um, And Kyle Gray, who is a Scottish angel teacher, he has some beautiful books out and some card decks. He is one of the first people that I am aware of really talking very much at all about Archangel Orion. And Kyle Gray says that Orion's name means rising in the sky rising in the sky so now all the angel mean names mean something and so um, I think it's very helpful to understand what they mean so that we can kind of 
you know, figure out what their purpose is, actually. So Archangel Orion, people kind of started noticing him just in like the last 10, 15, 20 years. And it is said that this is a new archangel who is making his energy available to our planet. And all of you know, I'm sure that we are going through a lot of rapid change. There are a lot of people having spiritual awakenings on the planet. Um, Obviously, we've got some pretty big issues going on with global warming and things like that. Um, I just heard something last night, you know, about um, mass extinctions, you know, that were expected. And day before I read about, you know, 40 percent of the bugs of the world are are going to go away in the next ever how many years. So, you know, there's a lot out there to be concerned about with our beautiful environment. I mean, we're so blessed to have so much nature, the trees and the plants and the animals all around us here. And yet, unfortunately, on this planet, uh, some of our uh, decisions that we made along the way uh, were most of us, I think it's our our parents and grandparents and so on, um, were not ones that were kind in terms of caring for the earth. It was more decisions that were taking advantage of the earth. So um, we're embarking, I think, now on a new horizon where we're going to have to learn to really take good care of the earth again to take good care of Gaia, uh, because Gaia is here for us and so nurturing of us. Now, you take that Gaia, you take that earth energy, and you contrast it with this archangel, Archangel Orion, and you've got about a complete opposite. Um, Archangel Orion brings new information for a new world and helps us to connect with the cosmos so that we can understand our very own special place in the world. So this is an angel. Now, I just have to tell you, I have been connecting with him really just over the last few months. And I have to say he just shows up. And when he shows up, I see these stars, this constellation of stars. And I see this midnight blue sky with these beautiful stars. Now, initially, I did not know who this was or what this was. But as I began to take a look at the information that is out there about Orion, I realized that's who this is. And um, Kyle Gray says Orion is a vast angel who appears as a handsome figure who is made up entirely of stars. So there you go. This is what I've been seeing. And perhaps some of you listening into the show have been seeing Orion as well. And he looks down uh, from above. And his aura is like the beautiful night sky. And there are these deep blues and indigos and glints of uh, white light shining through it, sparkly white light. It's just amazing to see him and feel him and sense his presence. Um, He is quite immense, actually. And um, Kyle Gray tells a story about when he discovered Orion was back in 2012, Uh, And his angels started talking to him about there's a new archangel that's coming and you're going to meet him and so on and so forth. And Kyle is all excited about that. And we, we do occasionally get some new archangels, don't we? And so he was um, at that point in time in 2012 in England and he was getting ready to launch one of his books. And so someone gave him a ticket to a Doreen Virtue workshop. And Doreen Virtue, as you probably know, is uh, one of the great mothers of uh, really connecting us in this modern time with the angelic realm. Now, she's kind of changed her tune a little bit. She's more into uh, traditional Christian beliefs now. But back in the day, she was really opening things up for folks related to connecting with the angels. And I am one of those people um, here to tell you she really did a lot for me in helping me to learn to connect with the angelic realm. So here he is in London, England, going to this Doreen Virtue class in 2012. This is Kyle Gray. And 
he does this meditation to meet his angels. And it's one of the things Doreen does. Uh, you know, just, just notice who comes in and, you know, ask them about themselves and what are they here to teach you and so on. So he's there in this guided meditation. And all of a sudden he hears the name Orion and just plain as day and just over and over and over again. And so he realized this is the archangel that he was supposed to work with that his angels that he already had been working with had told him about. So when we get back, I'll tell you a little bit more about that. But um, this is a fabulous angel. So I'm very excited about sharing with you about him. So stay tuned, everybody. I'm Marcia Hebrang. This is Spiritual Awakenings coming to you live from the BBM Global Network and Tune In Radio. We will be right back. French Rastafarian baker Chef Hugues Mott is a fourth generation baker and has worked in 11 countries across three continents. Born in Mulhouse, France, he began apprenticing in his father's bakery at age 12 and has devoted his life to learning cultures of the world from inside kitchens across the globe. He also teaches traditional French baking by hosting demonstrations and classes, and his passion for baking is reflected in his delicious confections. With a deep respect for discipline and his Rastafarian way of life, Sheikh Uvmat exemplifies commitment to tradition and culture in a global world. Traveling extensively and combining a myriad of flavors into his recipes, Chef Ugmat brings a unique approach to baking. To read more about the French Rastafarian baker, visit www.frenchchefoug.com. That's H-U-G-U-E-S. Bon appétit and bless up. Welcome back, everybody. I'm Marcia Hebrink, and this is Spiritual Awakenings, coming to you live from the BBM Global Network and Tune In Radio. And today we're sharing about angels and crystals and stones and spiritual healing. And our angel today on the show is Archangel Orion, O-R-I-O-N, whose name means rising in the sky. Whew, how beautiful is that? So um, back to Kyle Gray and when he discovered Orion, um, so he had been told in this meditation he had in his Doreen Virtue class that Orion was one of his angels that he was to work with. And afterward, he went to a birthday party that some of his friends and family were having for him. And so he had asked Orion, I believe after the meditation, please give me a sign, you know, that I'm getting this right. If you're real and you want to work with me, let me know for sure that you're the angel for me to work with. So he goes to his birthday party, and lo and behold, uh, his family had created a cake for him made out of cupcakes, and they all had stars on them. And of course, stars are a big thing that is associated with Orion. So he was like, whoa, look at this, you know, this is a sign. And then he starts opening his presents for his birthday, and there is this beautiful present that came to him from one of his clients where she had named a star in his honor and he opened the little you know papers and saw that the name of the star that she had named in his honor was Orion and he had no idea and she had no idea you know that you know I mean this is obviously a synchronicity and the angels will often communicate with us through synchronicities They'll also give us signs like, you know, the stars on his birthday cake. Um, And they'll also, if we ask the angels, um, let me know that you're with me. Let me know that you're present. They'll give you angel feathers. They'll give you messages through other people, all kinds of things. But it was very clear to Kyle that Orion was definitely an angel that he was meant to work with. Now, what kind of things can Orion help us with? Um, I just have to tell you this. This is kind of cute. There are people who refer to Orion as the hipster angel (laughs) because he's kind of hip. He's kind of new on the scene. And uh, so anyway, I like that. Uh, But one of the big things that Orion can help us with is finding our divine life purpose. And there are some beautiful writings that Kyle Gray has about what Orion says about life purpose. And I just want to share this with you. Um, Here it is. And this is something that he channeled from Archangel Orion. Your life purpose does not define you. 
You are defined by love. Love is the only part of you that is real and will continue to exist when your human body is gone. Just because you have to create abundance to live does not mean that your career defines your life purpose. Your life purpose is to remember that you are an essence of love. If you can align every thought, action, and deed with love, you are living your true divine life purpose. Nothing is more important than that. Okay, so those are Orion's words as channeled by Kyle Gray. And so Orion is an angel who reminds us that love is our true purpose. Love is why we're here. And sometimes we do, I don't know about you guys, but sometimes we do get caught up in, on this earth plane, (laughs) having to make a living, okay? We got to do it. We got to pay the bills. We got to pay the rent or the mortgage. We got to pay the car payment and our credit card bills, whatever it is we might have, okay? Buy our food at the grocery store. And so, got to have a paycheck of some sort, whether we're self-employed or employed by others, got to be able to pay those bills. And we get caught up in that. And sometimes the angels say, you know, it becomes a little more important to us than it should be. When in fact, if we follow our passion, if we do what we love, we do what makes us happy, and we move forward with the help of the angels to manifest what our real divine purpose is, which is love. We're going to be happier and healthier, and we might just even have more abundance. So I'll just kind of drop that uh, thought in your lap there for a little minute. Um, So again, this is a life purpose angel. Now, who are the other life purpose angels? Okay, you guys might remember me talking about this on another show, or you might already know it. Shamuel is an angel who can help us with our life purpose. Shamuel is called the finder angel. He helps us find what we're looking for. Maybe a job, maybe a life partner, maybe a house, place to live, friends, whatever it may be. So Shamuel is one that can help us find our purpose. Um, Another life purpose angel is Archangel Michael. And he is one that I like to work with a lot on divine life purpose work. And I tend to do a fair bit of that with my angel therapy clients. So if you're interested in that, um, go to my website and check it out, onelightcenter.com. I'd be happy to work with you. Another angel of divine life purpose is Archangel Nathaniel. And his name is spelled N-A-T-H-A-N-I-E-L. Now again, Nathaniel is one of the younger archangels. Um, Really didn't hear about him until maybe starting in like the 50s or so. Um, And actually Charles Virtue, who I studied with in Sedona and in... um, New Jersey, um, he wrote uh, a very wonderful, um, gosh, I don't know what you would call it, a lesson, I guess, would be what you would call it, um, that is uh, available on hayhouse.com, and it's all about Archangel Nathaniel, and I think, I want to say it costs like 5 or $10, and it's totally worth it, because there's just, again, like Orion, there's not a lot of information out there in the world about Nathaniel. Archangel Nathaniel is a very... Mm, very heady, uh, heavy duty, uh, powerful angel of life purpose. And if you ask him for his support, whoa, he will really get behind you and helping you move forward in the direction of your dreams. Now, who else helps with life purpose? I don't know. The angels are just telling me to remind you guys of this. I also like to work with Archangel Gabriel. Now, Gabriel is an angel that will help writers, people who write books, articles. He helps creative people of all kinds. So artists, um, musicians, singer-songwriters, anybody who is creative, people who work in clay, um, people who are creating 
major projects. Um, Gabriel is fabulous. Also, if you're having to be a public speaker giving speeches, Gabriel is wonderful to call in. But I also find he helps with life purpose, too. So we're going to take a break. When we get back, I want to tell you more about Orion and about some crystals, too, that are connected to him. I'm Marcia Hebrang. This is Spiritual Awakenings, coming to you live from the BBM Global Network and Tune In Radio. Stay tuned, everybody. If you seek a courageous advocate, prepare to champion your rights with consumer service agencies that support aging populations, Carol Ann Hamilton is the one for you. Carol Ann is an elder care coach, author, and speaker with a quarter million hours lived experience successfully supporting unculpable aging parents. As a result of a challenging journey, Carol Ann revolutionizes how stressed out caregivers restore serenity to their worlds. She also brings over 25 years of change management expertise in Fortune 500 settings to catalyze urgent transformation within the elder care industry. Carol Ann is a popular speaker at conferences across North America. She has appeared via TV, radio, and print globally. Now you can tune in weekly to get a dose of her inspiration plus down-to-earth advice to cope with even the most difficult aging parents. Listen Wednesdays at 9 a.m. Eastern on Bold Brave Media and TuneIn Radio. Essential Nutrients, LLC, is the brainchild of entrepreneur Barbara Burns. Inspired by a desire to help others, Barbara worked with a team of scientists to develop unique nutritional liquid supplements with the goal to improve the quality of your life. Glucosamine, zinc, and calcium are essential to well-being, and this is the focus of Essential Nutrients, LLC. Whether you're a professional athlete, weekend warrior, student, business owner, or homemaker, Essential Nutrients offers products for everyone, including the family pet. And they're easy to take, no pills. Health requires commitment, exercise, a good diet, proper supplementation, and action. So take action today and get your supply of essential liquid nutrients by visiting www.essential-liquids.com. Don't put off your health any longer. Take essential products today and start to measure the difference. Welcome back, everybody. I'm Marcia Hebrank, and you're listening to Spiritual Awakenings, coming to you live from the BBM Global Network and Tune In Radio. And today we're talking about angels and crystals and stones and spiritual healing. And our topic today is Archangel Orion, O-R-I-O-N, Orion. And uh, I've got some stones here that one of which is kind of an official Orion stone, uh, you know, people are saying is very, very connected to him. And some others that when I asked him and connected with him, he asked me to share with you about briefly. So I'll tell you about those too. So Orion is known to be connected with dark blue sandstone. Dark blue sandstone. Now, I do not have any of that. Um, I wish I did, but I don't. He is also connected to peacock ore, and that's spelled P E A C O C K, two words, O R E, peacock ore. And I have a beautiful piece of peacock ore here, and I will snap a picture of these crystals and stones as well as the card that I'm going to pull in a little bit. Uh, and put them on my Facebook business page later on, and that is facebook.com forward slash messages from moon. Messages from moon. Moon is my nickname. So the peacock ore that I have here is quite luscious looking. Um, It can come with a whole gradient of colors on it. It's kind of coppery looking, and it has just the colors of a peacock, if you've ever seen a peacock. The vivid, though, dark blue and aqua and green and a little bit of white on there and some golden. It's just sparkly and amazing. And uh, I I will put a picture on the Facebook business page so you can see it. So if you want to get closer to this particular archangel, Archangel Orion, work with that peacock ore and it will help you to do that. 
I wanted to mention a couple of other stones that um, he told me were very much ones that would help to connect folks with him. And one of those is sodalite. And that is spelled S-O-D-A-L-I-T-E, sodalite. And so I'll put a picture of that on my Facebook business page as well for you to see. And the sodalite is kind of a, um, a navy, uh, a dark blue to navy colored stone. Sometimes it can have a little bit of white in it. Um, so I think now, without further ado, I think I'll go ahead and pull a card for us. And I am using, um, again this time, I think I may have used these my all time before last, I have a deck of angel cards called Angel Prayers Oracle Cards. And these are by Kyle Gray, who I mentioned earlier. So let's go ahead and I'm going to ask that uh, the angels bring a card forward for everybody who's listening into the show, either now live or on rebroadcast. And so let's go ahead and close our eyes. And I'm going to pray over these cards. Great Spirit, Mother, Father, God, beautiful angels, archangels, ascended masters, spirit helpers, spirit teachers, spirit guides of the light, guardian angels. We call you all in into this place in time for the purpose of providing your loving guidance to all those individuals who are listening into the show, Spiritual Awakenings, either live or on rebroadcast. Whatever we need to know about, be aware of, or do for our highest and best good. And we call it in particular Archangel Orion. And we call in Archangel Michael and Archangel Raphael, Archangel Gabriel, Archangel Uriel, these and any others. Angels, we thank you so much for bringing us your wisdom. And we are grateful. And so it is. All right. My goodness. Oh, I have goosebumps. All right. Thank you, angels. So this beautiful card that we have is a very interesting card. I don't think I have ever pulled this card before from this deck. And on the card, there is a picture of a beautiful Native American man. And he's wearing a feather um, on his head. And behind him is a beautiful eagle. And it's the the spirit eagle, actually. It's the head of the eagle that is right behind him. And the message of this card, so this is the spirit animal card. And the message is, thank you, animal kingdom, for blessing my path with love. Now, the eagle is a very special, special being, very powerful. And in Native American uh, tradition, really the eagle was one of the most revered uh, spirit animals that there was or is. And the eagle is believed to be able to fly higher than any other bird and able to go all the way to the sun. Very, very powerful being. And so I'll tell you a little bit more about this card. Uh, The meaning of this card is that the angels are sending you love and blessings through the animals that are in your own life. And you may have a pet here on the earth, a dog or a cat or a bird, and it may even be one who has moved on to heaven. And know that the loving blessings of your pet are with you at this time. This could even be a pet that you had when you were young. Uh, It could be from a long time ago or it could be now. And the angels are encouraging you to connect with the animal kingdom even more and draw inspiration from it. And they want you to know that the animals bring messages of peace and harmony for you and that you're encouraged to really enjoy this. Um, I'll tell you a little bit more about this card. Uh, This card is saying that the consciousness of the animal kingdom is surrounding you right now. 
and it's bringing messages to you from your guardian angels. I'll tell you a little bit more about this when we get back. Uh, We're going to take a quick little break. I'm Marcia Hebrank, and this is Spiritual Awakenings, coming to you live from the BBM Global Network and TuneIn Radio. We will be right back. Are you looking for employment and live in Los Angeles, Orange, Riverside, and San Bernardino counties? Jobs Annex is the place for you. Are you an employer looking to fill a position or quite a few positions in Los Angeles, Orange, Riverside, and San Bernardino counties? Jobs Annex is for you. Employers, JobsAnnex.com is your resource for career-minded people. JobsAnnex.com is the convenient place for job seekers and employers to hook up and move forward. Jobs Annex has been serving Los Angeles, Orange, Riverside, and San Bernardino counties for over four years. 14 years. Jobs Annex is a former employment search firm. We've evaluated many thousands of resumes and we understand what employers want and what job applicants need to be successful in their interviews. At Jobs Annex, we provide you with the tools to tell your story for free. Our resources at JobsAnnex.com will help each applicant construct an award-winning resume, an eye-catching cover letter, and key interview questions to ask in various types of interviews. Best of all, it's free. JobsAnnex.com. That's J-O-B-S-A-N-N-E-X.com. Author, radio show host, and coach, John M. Hawkins, reveals strategies to help gain perspective, build confidence, find clarity, achieve goals. John M. Hawkins' new book, Coached to Greatness, Unlock Your Full Potential with Limitless Growth. Published by iUniverse, Hawkins reveals strategies to help readers accomplish more. He believes the book can coach them to greatness. Hawkins says that the best athletes get to the top of their sport with the help of coaches, mentors, and others. He shares guidance that helps readers reflect on what motivates them, rediscover and assess their core values, philosophies, and competencies, find settings that allow them to be the most productive, and track their progress towards accomplishing goals. Listen to John Hawkins' My Strategy, Saturdays, 1 p.m. Eastern, on the BBM Global Network and to in radio. Welcome back, everybody. I'm Marcia Hebrank, and this is Spiritual Awakenings, coming to you live from the BBM Global Network and Tune In Radio. And today we're talking about angels and crystals and uh, spiritual healing and stones. And we did a card drawing uh, right before the break, and this was from Kyle Gray's deck, Angel Prayers Oracle Cards. It's a wonderful deck, uh, and he has a wonderful book by the same name. And the card that I pulled is Spirit Animal. And the message of the card is, Thank you, Animal Kingdom, for blessing my path with love. Now, I do want to say, as a shamanic practitioner, which is another thing that I do, I I have kind of a sweet job. I I get to do what I love. Um, And so one of the things I help people with as a shamanic practitioner is to get to know their spirit animals. And just like we all have guardian angels, we all have spirit animals who are with us, who are there to be of assistance to us in all kinds of amazing ways. And so I feel like this is partly why this card has come up today, just for me to mention that to you that you do have a spirit animal with you so that the angels are bringing that message through. And I'll tell you a little bit more about this card. It's saying that if you have felt encouraged to help the animal kingdom in any way by being a vegetarian or helping out animal rescue or adopting a pet, the angels want you to know that they encourage you to follow that guidance because it is important. And the angels are saying that you have not only a guardian angel, but you have a spirit animal that is with you at this time and wants to help you. And so you're encouraged right now. Let's go ahead and do this together. Let's go ahead and close our eyes. And let's ask our spirit animal to come to us and show itself to us. And we might see it, we might feel it, we might hear it, we might sense it, we might just know its presence is with us. Trust the first thing that you see or hear or feel or sense about that animal. And know that you're not alone. You have this wonderful little spirit animal 
or big, some of them are quite large, who is with you to help you, to bring you healing, to bring you power, to help protect you, all kinds of beautiful things. So you may want to just work with that a little bit. Um, This is an angel message. So I've got a little crossover here between uh, angel work and and shamanism. But know that uh, the spirit animals are quite beautiful beings and they're here to help all of us. So back to our angel of the day here, Archangel Orion. Um, I was sharing a little bit ago about the peacock ore that I have in front of me. And I will put that on my Facebook business page for you to see it. Messages from Moon. Also about the stone uh, sodalite, S-O-D-A-L-I-T-E, which Orion is telling me that is a very good stone to work with to help connect you with him. Now, there is another one that he told me, and I talked about this stone on a previous show, so I'm not going to go into it again, as I did about sodalite as well on a previous show. But this is azurite, and that is spelled A-Z-U-R-I-T-E. And azurite um, has these little tiny berries on it, and it is a vivid dark blue it is just absolutely gorgeous and sparkly and azurite again is another stone that can connect you with him now i have one more to tell you about and this one kind of surprised me but he said no this is a great stone to uh, work with to connect you with me and this is archangel orion again and this stone is ruby kyanite Ruby kyanite. It is co-occurring kyanite and ruby. And it is absolutely beautiful. So I'll put this on my Facebook business page for you to see as well. Um, it has the kind of the the bluish kyanite color and then the uh, ruby red is all blended in together with it. And it's just an amazing stone. It has a beautiful, very strong, uh, marvelous frequency. So let me tell you a little bit more about our angel of the day, Archangel Orion. Orion is the angel of manifestation. He can help us to manifest amazing things in our lives. Now, this is about big things, okay? This isn't about, you know, oh, I'd like to have, you know, um, a different boom box or, you know, whatever it is. If people still have boom boxes, I don't know. I'm showing my age. Um, but, you know, this is about big things. What do you want to manifest in your life? Do you want a new life partner? Okay. Do you want to do something really important while you're here on the planet? That's the kind of thing that Orion can really get up under and help you with. He can bring you information about the steps that you need to take to put this manifesting work that you're doing into action on the planet so that your dreams can become a reality. Um, He's very serious and he's very intense. And when I have connected with him, he is just absolutely huge. Um, So know that this isn't about manifesting little stuff. This is an angel to help you manifest the big things in life. He is also an angel to help you with the big questions that you have. So, again, this would not be an angel to ask, where did I leave my car keys? (laughs) You might ask your guardian angel about that. They probably know. Um, This would be an angel who you could ask something like, what is my divine purpose? Um, how am I to embrace love um, more in my life? I mean, big, big questions like that. Big, important questions. The ones that are really on your heart, the ones that really matter to you, this is a fabulous archangel to take those questions to. Now, how do you do that? Okay, well, a couple of ways I would suggest. One of them is before you go to bed at night, Call in Archangel Orion. And when we call it an angel, we do it with respect. We do it uh, with love, with kindness, with gentleness. But, you know, it's kind of like calling in your best friend. You just call them on in and you thank them for being there. And you say something like this, Archangel Orion, I would love for you in my dreams tonight 
just to show me more about what my divine life purpose is in this incarnation on the planet. And I appreciate you so much. Thank you. And then you lay down and go to sleep. And when you wake up in the morning... Okay, you may have some dreams that are very important and he may have given you this information in your dreams. And so write it down, whatever you remember. And if you don't remember it, know that he will have planted the seeds of wisdom within you and you will have knowings that will come to you gradually over time about what you asked for. So that's one of my favorite ways to ask angels for information. We're getting ready to take a quick little break. I'll be back shortly and tell you some more about this angel. I'm Marcia Hebrank, and you're listening to Spiritual Awakenings. We are coming to you live from the BBM Global Network and TuneIn Radio. Stay tuned. We'll be right back. Renaissance woman, trailblazer, maverick. Those are just some of the words to describe to Chandra Poulard, owner and CEO of House Virgo Entertainment, LLC, a woman minority veteran-owned entertainment company based in Washington, D.C., Ms. Poulard served 10 years honorably in the United States Navy and departed from active duty to pursue her dreams of becoming an entertainment mogul. House of Virgo Entertainment offers script writing, producing, directing, DJ services, editing, and more. They cater to businesses, corporations, college students, working professionals, aspiring artists and nonprofit organizations, and employ veterans of the armed forces. Tashandra Poulard is pioneering the way we view media and taking her brand global. Visit her at www.houseofvirgoentertainment.com or call 281-515-3740 and like her on Facebook at House of Virgo Entertainment, LLC. Have you ever wondered why some children recover from their symptoms of autism while others never seem to get any better? After 13 years of research, Karen Thomas has recovered her own son from his symptoms of autism naturally. She now shares how she did it with you in her free webinar so that you can have the right resources and knowledge to help your child. The definition of recovery is to regain health. Karen offers this to you in four stages. Healing the gut, natural heavy metal detoxification, balancing the co-infections of autism, brain support, and repair. Register now for this free webinar to help you know what you can do to help your child to sleep better, be more calm, improve focus, and reach their fullest potential to live a happy, healthy life. Go to naturallyrecoveringautism.com forward slash free workshop empowering parents with the resources to naturally recover autism from a mom who's done it welcome back everybody i'm marcia hebrank and this is spiritual awakenings coming to you live from the bbm global network and tune in radio and today we're talking about angels and crystals and stones and spiritual healing and uh, our Topic today is a very special angel. This is Archangel Orion, O R I O N, Orion. And this again is a newer angel. He's been around for a while, he's been serving the earth, but he is stepping up more vocally and actively now to guide us and support us on our ascension journey. And so, this is a great angel to get to know. So I thought that today, in order to get to know him better, all of us, uh, myself included, perhaps we would do a guided meditation and we'll call him in and ask to connect with him together. And there is power in togetherness, isn't there? So let's do that together and uh, let's go ahead right now, all of us, and just close your eyes. And take a few long, slow, deep, easy breaths in and out. Breathing in peace and serenity. Breathing out any stress, any tension. Breathing in joy. And breathing out any worries any things we cannot change, releasing those to the angels, breathing in love and light for the light worker that you are, 
and breathing out love and light. And imagine yourself now walking outward. Visualize yourself walking forward on a beautiful white crystalline pathway of light. And see yourself coming forward out into a big open space in nature. Perhaps it's a big open field, a meadow. And it is nighttime. And allow yourself now in this beautiful place, in the velvet darkness where you are safe and surrounded by angels. Allow yourself to look up into the magnificent nighttime sky and notice that sky full of stars. Each star special, unique, sparkling in the sky sparkling just as you do. And see your attention drawn to a particular aspect of that night sky. See your attention and your energy being drawn up and up and up to a constellation that draws you to it into that constellation where we will find Archangel Orion and allow yourself now to come forward into his space and time looking into his beautiful face his beautiful energy perhaps we might see that dark blue you might see those white stars around him and now place your hands in his and ask Archangel Orion to bring you a message of love, a message of support. Whatever it is you may need to know about or be aware of. And receive that message from Archangel Orion now. And if you would like for Archangel Orion to be on your angel team, to be with you as a guide, to be with you as a helper, to help you with your divine purpose or help you to understand something that is very important to you. Go ahead now and place your intention with Orion, Archangel Orion. I place my intention lovingly and respectfully with you to work with you as my angel teacher, as my angel guide to help me to understand and know the important things that there are for me to know. How can I help those on this planet at this time of awakening? What is my divine life purpose? What steps do I need to take to fulfill my purpose? Help me to know about these things. Bring your beautiful wisdom to me in my dreams. Partner with me to know what I need to know to initialize my purpose in the world to the best of my abilities for my highest good and the highest good of others. And I am grateful. Thank you, Archangel Orion. And see yourself now just giving Archangel Orion a great big hug. And thank him for his help. And see yourself now slowly and gently coming back down from that starry place all the way back down into that meadow surrounded by angels. Back in that place of serenity 
and see yourself turning slowly and gently back around, coming back down that white crystalline pathway of light, coming all the way back into your body, all the way back into here and now, feeling different, feeling empowered. You have a new partner in the angelic realm now who is ready and willing to help you. And when you are ready, open your eyes. And we are going to take a quick break. I'm Marcia Hebrank, and this is Spiritual Awakenings coming to you live from the BBM Global Network and TuneIn Radio. We'll be right back. Introducing BetterHomeAndGarden.com. That's www.BetterHomeAndGarden.com with just the letter N in Better Home and Garden. BetterHomeAndGarden.com offers you the highest quality products on the market that are environmentally safe and effective and to make them available to you at the lowest possible prices. BetterHomeAndGarden.com understands that kind of creativity and do-it-yourself attitude. Thus, we developed our website, BetterHomeAndGarden.com. BetterHomeAndGarden.com offers you the following products right online. Bath, bedding, collectibles, craft, sewing and hobby, food and beverage, furniture, home decor, kitchen and dining, lamps and lighting, large appliances, musical instruments, outdoor cooking, patio items, pet supplies, plant and garden, rug and floor covering, small appliances, travel and luggage, and so much more. Better Home and Garden is an online retailer offering a wide variety of high-quality brand name merchandise at discount prices. Our service is personal and we aim to please. Visit us at www.betterhomeandgarden.com. Make your home your own. There are artists and then there's Alice Asmar. This award-winning artist has spent her entire life devoted to her artistic pursuits and has had a lifelong fascination with American Indians of the southwestern United States. Her book, Dance to the Great Spirit, showcases her drawings and paintings inspired by sacred rituals of the Pueblo Indians and four of her lithographs are in permanent collection at the National Museum of American History and the Smithsonian Institution in Washington, D.C. She is one of four artists in the United States to win a Woolley Fellowship for study in Paris at Le Colde Beaux Arts and has been featured in numerous publications. She's exhibited at the world's most prestigious museums and galleries and recently won a 20 year service award from the Burbank City Council and the inaugural art competition of the Foundation of the United States in Paris. Visit www.asmarart.com, www.aliceasmarinternational.com, and email alice at aliceasmar at AOL. Welcome back, everybody. I'm Marcia Hebrank, and this is Spiritual Awakenings, coming to you live from the BBM Global Network and Tune In Radio. And today we're talking about angels and crystals and stones and spiritual healing. And today our subject matter is Archangel Orion, O-R-I-O-N. He is considered to be a galactic archangel, an angel of the cosmos, and he is associated with the stars, in fact, quite amazing. And uh, other things to know about him, Orion broadcasts healing light and frequency towards the earth through the center of the three stars that make up the constellation known as Orion's Belt, Orion's Belt. Um, he has lots of insight and guidance. He's connected to uh, very, very advanced esoteric wisdom. And he's able to share this with us in very amazing, magical ways. He helps to support us and support the universe we're living in, helps us to manifest a life that is positive for us and helpful to the planet. He is very easy to hear and see and understand understand and so I highly encourage you to work with him similar to Archangel Michael he can help with clearing and protecting moving out dark energies and things like that so know that this is a great angel to have on your healing team if you are interested in angel therapy or angel readings you can find me on www.onelightcenter.com it's o-n-e-l-i-g-h-t c-e-n-t-e-r.com and there's lots of information there about the healings that I do I also teach angel intuition and healing and an advanced angel intuition healing won't be teaching that until early next year but i'm happy to connect with any of you who are interested in learning more about the angels and if you want someone to come and teach about the angels where you live if you can get 
you know, a room full of people, I will come out and teach, and so will my husband. We would be very excited to do that. So just drop me an email at marciahebrank at yahoo.com. It's M-A-R-C-I-A-H-E-B-R-A-N-K at yahoo.com. So here is a prayer to Archangel Orion that is mentioned in Kyle Gray's beautiful book, Angel Prayers. And so I just wanted to close with this today. Thank you, Archangel Orion, for inspiring me and filling my life with your beautiful starry energy. I am open to receiving your guidance. Thank you for revealing to me whatever I need to know. I align all of my thoughts and actions with love, knowing that this is the real and infinite part of myself. I am safe and well, knowing you are with me. And so it is. Isn't that beautiful? So this is a very protective archangel. Um, You know, we can certainly do with some protection out there in the world the way it is today. Um, You know, there's a lot of love out there. There's a lot of goodness out there. But it's good to have a very protective angel on your angel team. Uh, Another protective angel, just like Archangel Michael is. And uh, I want to encourage all of you to just continue to work with the angels every day. And know that they're there for you and they will show up in your life in exactly the way they need to at exactly the right time, Uh, sometimes in very miraculous ways. And one thing about this angel I want to mention to you, Orion can help you to manifest miracles in your life. So I'll just plant that seed with you as well. So I'm sending you so much love, wishing you a great rest of your week. Come connect with us again next Tuesday at 4 Eastern. And Om Namaste. Many, many blessings. You've been listening to Spiritual Awakenings with your host, Marsha Hebrank. Join us each week as we discover and explore how angels, spirit guides, and spirit teachers through their guidance can nurture, heal, and balance our lives on Marsha Hebrank's Spiritual Awakenings. You've been listening to the BBM Global Network. The ideas, views, and opinions of this broadcast are those of the participants of the program and are not necessarily the ideas, views, and opinions of the BBM Global Network Company.